Voltei, galera, com Alan Wake aqui no canal e vamos nessa. Nós temos que tirar a foto que é. <risos> então nós vamos. <risos> e aí, tiozão? Olá, você escolheu um bom momento para visitar a nossa cidade. Você está apenas duas semanas de longe. Deer Fest, hein? Você ouviu isso, filho? Nós estamos aqui, querida, desse lado. Nós não estamos aí onde você está tirando a foto. Se você não me importa, eu vou dizer isso. Eu sou o Pat Main, por favor. Muito bom te encontrar. Sim, eu sou Alan Wake. Eu não vou pretender que eu não reconheça um escritor famoso como você, Sr. Wake. Eu vou te dizer que eu não vou reconhecer um escritor como você, Sr. Wake. Eu vou te dizer que eu não vou reconhecer um escritor como você, Sr. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host at the local radio station. Any chance I could get an interview? Look, Mr. Maine, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. You can trust me to be discreet. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. O velhinho não gostou muito. <risos> Mas o cara tá tirando férias, né? Eu não sei se isso, né? Eu acho que ele devia ficar preocupado na hora que ele começasse a tirar as férias e a galera não desse mais bola pra ele. Aí ele devia ficar preocupado, né? Are you there yet? Barry. Yeah. We just got here. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry, we're fine. Great. Great. Just want to make sure you can relax and recharge. So, how is the place? Has it gotten your creative juices flowing? Barry, we're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. Chegamos, chegamos. Mas eu queria dar uma explorada aqui, tio. Calma aí, calma aí. Vamos dar uma exploradinha aqui. Ah, tá fechado. E eu não consigo pular. Beleza. Come on, Slowpoke. You get the full service here. I've made all the arrangements. I drive the car. I'll even carry the bags. All you have to do is drag your cute butt into the car and enjoy the ride. Yeah, sounds like you've got a lazy bastard for husband. Let's see who has the last laugh, city boy. Okay. Good day to you too. Gostei desse brother aqui não, compadre. Yeah, but I got a thing for him. Come on, you lazy bastard. Let's go. Então tá. Vamos nessa. We need to stop at the local diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. A Mr. Carl Stucky. He's waiting for us. I'll go fill her up while you get the key. I'll pick you up here in, say, 15 minutes. Sure. Alan, thank you for coming here with me. I love you too. Go on. I'll promise to behave. I'd forgotten there were still places like this. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Welcome to the Oh Dear Diner. Hi, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking for... Mr. Wake. Alan Wake. Oh, God! I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose. I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Oh, of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the restroom. He'll be back in a moment. I can't believe it. I've got all your books. I got the cutout from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. E você mantém aqui. Bem, ok. Bom para você. Então tá, né? Já tem uma doida lá. Não se preocupe. Não me culpe quando você se encontra em amor. 
because it'll break your heart when you have to leave. Rusty here is no longer human. Nothing but black coffee under a thin layer of skin. Yeah, that makes two of us. Então tá. Encontre o Crawl. Ele tá no banheiro. Favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Bad circulation. Yeah. Are you serious? Coconut again? You disgust me. Call yourself a rocker. Unbelievable. Ha! Tá bom, vamos botar aqui o coconut. You put the lime in the coconut, drink them both up. Just because we're brothers, don't think I won't murder you in it your sleep. It does that. Get stuck. Yeah, you need to give it a good solid whack. Yes, that's my favorite tune. Coconut. Shut your mouth, you demented has been. If I had my hammer, I'd shut it for you. Jeez. Não vai ligar as cinco estrelas se eu bater aqui não, né, tia? Tune number six in the jukebox. Children of the elder god. Now there's now, a song for you. Now that's what I'm talking you. about. Yes. This is it. I've died and gone to hell. Eu <risos> morri agora todo no inferno. Eu tirei a música, tá, galera? Porque vocês sabem que tem probleminhas de direitos autorais. E aí, tia Zona? Tranquilidade? Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. The waitress was giving me a headache. Overeager fans always did. Estamos entrando no lugar escuro. Eu tô sem arma nenhuma. Até porque eu tava no sonho, né? Agora eu tô na vida real. Bater. Hello. Mr. Stucky? Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. Thanks. Será que nós estamos no sonho ainda? Aparentemente. Lake is a special place, very inspiring. Aparentemente ela tem sombra. Saia da cafeteria. Uhum. Tá, tem que voltar por onde eu estava, é assim, senhor. É, eu não fiquei não, senhora. Prazer, hein? Lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. This really ought to be fixed, and then I must remind Sarah to change the lights at the station. It's been too long already. <laughs> Even that sounds better than you singing. Are you all right? <laughs> splendid, splendid. <laughs> Damn hernia. It swells up like a balloon if I lift anything heavier than a spoon. Yeah. Splendid, splendid. It's been a long time, Tom. Good to see you. Hey, you wouldn't happen to have a bottle on you, would you, Tom? I wish. The Andersons, they're, uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake Lodge. Ah, é por isso que tu tá aqui? Ah, ela chegou. Calma, querida. Estou indo. Bye, Mr. Wake. Tchau. Mission accomplished. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. Hey, wait! Mrs. Wake! Your... Your keys!
That diner was a real nut house. <laughs> Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. We can talk about this later. Batman here on PBF FM. I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Here's another one of my favorites to go with it. Once upon a time, I was a successful writer. But that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years. Not since my last book. And now the weather. It's gonna be a clear night, so you folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while and see those stars winking down at you. It gets pretty dark out here, but they'll light your way. Ah, copyright, no! <laughs> It's something, all right. Don't worry, honey. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. I know. I'm okay. Alice had a phobia. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. O casal perfeito, né? Um pensa na escuridão, o outro tem fobia da escuridão. Ah, você acertaram... Olha... Are you sure you read the directions right? It's nothing like in the brochure. It said near the lake, not on it. Don't get me wrong. This is so much better. It's wonderful. Our own private island. Vocês, olha, não sei qual é, o que que a galera tem de ir para lugar assim, cara. E é lógico que vai dar errado, velho. E é lógico que vai dar errado. Até na vida real dá errado para lugar assim. O lugar é bonito, é bonito. Os caras fizeram o lugar lindo pra caramba, mas não. Tá ligado? Não. Tem que ficar clicando para abrir. Let's take a look inside. It's dark in there. We need light. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? Tem um examinar. A shoebox filled with books by Thomas Zane sat on the shelf. I'd never heard of him before. Hello? Anyone here? Fui eu que falei isso? Fui eu, no caso, o Alan, né? Liga a chave de energia. Onde é que tá a chave de energia, tá ligado? Tem umas portas fechadas. E aí? For a moment, the oppressive feel of the nightmare I had seen on the ferry returned. Damn. I needed to get the power running in the cabin. There had to be a fuse box or a generator somewhere on the island. É, não dá para interagir. A gente só meio que foca a câmera. Ah, aqui, cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s or even earlier. July, é 1970? Caraca. Não, mas eu acho que não é a, o ano certo, né, que o jogo se passa. Porque não teria aquele carro ali em 1970. <risos> Definitivamente. Ah, enchei de corvo, Resident Evil, Resident Evil da Beth. Uma exploradinha ao redor, né, cara? Que sabe como é que é, né? Da partida. Ah, tem que ir ligando. Hum, interessante. Liguei a energia. Sucesso. Estamos energizados. Ok, eu vou olhar um pouco. 
It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I thought we could be happy here. A love story. Maybe it would be that again. Hmm. Tá anoitecendo. Ih, rapaz, quando anoitece, não é muito legal. Mas, galera, nós vamos ficando por aqui. Ah, já tá estranho. Vocês estão vendo que já tem um blur ali quando eu viro pra ele? E já tá no pesadelo de novo, já, galera. Bom, guys, vou ficando por aqui. Não esquece, deixa o seu like, compartilha o vídeo com os amigos. Inscreva-se no canal pra não perder os próximos vídeos. E volta aí amanhã que nós vamos continuar na nossa série de Alan Wake. Valeu, galera. Até mais. E fui.